Hi guys, you asking me, so here I am with an English word about my uh, FG race track. This is a one fifth scale chassis. You usually see it with a BMW, a Mercedes, uh, or somebody with a one meter and twenty. But FG made it also with track bodies, and with the track body, it's a one six scale track. It's a five hundred and thirty five millimeter wheelbase. And the biggest difference between the GT and uh, this truck are the tires. I take a truck because it's different. I take a truck because we have really fat tires. I have already an FG on road with the standard tires, but the problem is to put uh, heavy powers on the ground. Um, it's um, it's not easy to put heavy power on the ground with those smaller tires. And with these bigger wheels, it's way, way better. I take it also because uh, made the speed run with a GT body is easy. Uh, with a track body, it's way funnier. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I first made the setup in 18S with a um, uh, 5630mm motor. We can uh, go up to 110 volts. So I drive first with 18S. I drive with 8S with the biggest gear I can put on for my speed runs. But all this was not with the full uh, throttle power. I reach 90 km an hour with the stock gear. I reach 120 with uh, the um, speed gears because I have only 360 kV. The, uh, the, the goal for me is not to drive super fast, is to have a cool runtime and a cool uh, life for the battery and motor. So that was not the last stage with the hour motor. We will redo uh, so video with the hour motors maybe go a little bit up with the KV uh, or the setup I will see what I will do, do. but now I have uh, the last time uh, catched a 1720 mm motors that's a really huge motor it's a motor you've seen the feed uh, racing dragon hammer you see it in the low Z5B 12S uh, RTR version if you're gonna check the uh, RC car online point DE shop that's a German shop and there you can get the low Z5B with the ZDB Beast Pro 300 amp the uh, 720 mm motor with 680 kV. I take the 480 kV. I love to drive to drive low kV. I make a first test run with two uh, 6s 12,000 mAh battery. The goal for me is to reach a, 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 a real low amp draw to have a cool runtime for about 30 to 40 minutes uh, with cheap lipos you can do this if you drive it with really fat lipos uh, here in france in europe uh, they used to drive the 150 kill in 8s with 8s a 13000 milliamps battery the battery weighs about 2.5 kilograms and costs uh, 750 euros here i drive with two sexes 12000 milliamps who costs about 200 euro all two so i can buy three sets or four sets to have the same uh, end price as the ADAS setup. The electronic is the same price than the ADAS electronic. Um, but because I have lower KV and more S, I can uh, go down with the amps. And I only use this big motor because it's a truck. I want to put a big block in the truck because that's just the place where it goes. <laughs> but it's clear, the 60, uh, the 56 mm can motor will be enough. So this is my setup now. I have the 720, 400 AVKV motor. I can use it only also because we have here in France a shop who uh, make large scale who make themselves motor mounts because the stock motor mount you can get with an FG from FG is not able to take this motor. You have no room. And uh, with that one, I can do it. Uh, that one is also made so the motor is more in the back, so we have more place here uh, in for the lipos. How I say, 6s 12,000 milliamp uh, mother worth lipo battery, 90 euro each. I have here a three cell battery for the BET because I run here a Castle CC Back Pro with 7.4 volts. I love to have a little bit more volts on the battery than on the back because uh, 
you can just only put directly the lipo on the receiver if you take a 2s lipo but you don't will you not will have a constant voltage you will have a lot of voltage in the beginning and then the voltage go down and down and down and then the servo works the, uh, the the battery falls down and down and down and i love to use a back so i have surely each time 7.5 volts at the bet but it's just my choice you don't you don't need to do it what I hope is to soon see Hobby Ring and Castle made us 12S ESC uh, like the ZWB Beast 4 with anti spark who drives like a normal quick run. The problem from the ZWB Beast 4 hits himself a beast, he weighs 680 grams, it's a huge ESC and you have to find the room to put it in a 1 -fifth scale. So I drive on road so I don't need uh, to drive backwards. So I use a Flyer ESC, it's much cheaper. I have uh, paid for this 150 euros. All you have to do is to wire it with an anti-spark. It has no anti-spark integrate like the ZTV Beast Pro 300 amps uh, or like the Hobby Max 5, who's only for the moment 8S. I hope they will do as a Hobby Wing, uh, Max don't know what <laughs> but who can drive with 12s I need even more than 12s how I say with the smaller KV motor with 80s the 18s this track was really super to drive I drive with 18s 5000 milliamp battery about 25 minutes with 90 kilo, uh, kilometers an hour top speed I was not able to do that at this point with this motor because I have the I have gear it too high in the beginning and uh, also my cutoff was too high, I was read, uh, set it to uh, 3.6 volt. Uh, so I hope soon the weather will be fine so I can go out and try this new setup. I put a smaller gear in, I change the motor timing, I uh, go a little bit down with the uh, uh, cutoff from the SC. I don't know if I will be, if in the end it will work the way I like with this motor and this big battery. In the fact also, don't forget, we have here 1.7 kilograms for the motor, 1.7 for each battery. The truck weights now uh, on the road 40 kilograms. With my ATS setup with the smaller motor, which are only 1 kilograms, and I have the smaller battery, so with 18S I have only 1.8 kilogram batteries means two and a half uh, to three kilogram less weight in the track and that is uh, that is really much uh, you feel it on the road what I love with this heavy weight is that those heavy tires has a really even if they not hot a uh, fast uh, and good grip on the road and the tracks feel the track feel great to drive with this weight in the truck um, I was really happy to drive it uh, when I made the test run it was really cold outside and with the lighter battery I had uh, more uh, issue to keep the back from the truck on the straight line when I hit the throttle with this weight it's way easier to drive it's funnier to drive this way so I will see what happens with the runtime if I'm not happy I will, will switch back to the uh, smaller motor and ATS uh, or maybe a little bit more <laughs> I have some uh, IDs here, but I have to wait for this. Uh, I have to wait. Uh, really, that the ground is not so cold and now, um, because with the more ice I want to put in the track, I want to make uh, some speed run with a special setup. But for that, I really, really need the ground to be at the right temperature. <laughs> Remember me a Sean Paul song? <laughs> and um, I will also make, uh, I will try this next time to uh, make a bunch of English videos because many from you ask me uh, to do again English videos. I know. Many from you don't like it, but <laughs> for those who don't like me, just not uh, check my video out. <laughs> All of us are welcome. Bye, guys.